tasting like a boss. I have middle daughter of boss with me and we are trying. It's a bones flavor, just came out. Their Disney Haunted Mansion Brownie and Beyond. This is the first time that they've released a flavor and at the same time they released the flavor, they released a package, which is probably a good idea. And so when you got it, I thought you got like a PR package. Right, I was like, what yeah, you? yeah. I mean, I got the, uh, the Spider-Man flavor and if you look at the review, I wasn't a huge fan of the Spider-Man flavor, but they didn't have a mug or anything ready for me right away, right? Now, when they release it, they're releasing now, now theme-wise for Bones, uh, which is a Florida company. We support Florida companies. We got the floor. We got the Bones shirt on. But theme-wise, Nightmare Before Christmas, most of them were good. It was one that wasn't so hot. Spider-Man was kind of a eh. And the, the Indiana Jones ones were good, but they weren't like, I don't know if they, you know, blew me away. Right, but this time, what? I got the whole package here. I've got on the side of the package, little busts that sing to you. It's pretty cool. And the far back, got a little spooky dude. It says, reach for a cup far beyond and taste the decadent caramel brownie before it's gone. Okay, don't threaten me that it's gonna be gone already. Doesn't make sense. So anyway, we, we, get, we open up the box, and in the box, you've got the... Uh, uh, this is some... Uh, look at that. It's pretty, it's pretty cool. It's like, look at that. Look at that. Anyway, here's the, uh, the mug that's got the G for Gracie Manor on it. This is actually one of the most beautiful mugs, I think, they've ever done. So I'm really kind of excited about that. And, of course, there's the coffee. Now, we've opened this, obviously, because we have to grind up the coffee. It's nice this is like the, y'all seen the video of Katy Perry, she opens the Kim Kardashian sunglasses and she's like, whoo, because no. there's heads in it. I, no, Sorry, I have Sorry, that's just reminding me, it's like, Ooh. Okay, so there we go. All right, so anyway, <clears throat> here is the flavor. Haunted Mansion Brownie from Beyond. It's a caramel brownie. Boss of Boss, when she heard about the flavor, she said, why did they put caramel in it? She just wanted brownie. But she, she has also it. said that she liked it because she actually drank it before. So here's the bag. We got the spooky dude in the back. Again, replication of the bus over there. It's, you know, it's kind of an interesting thing. It's an interesting bag. Uh, it does not have the skeleton on there. So I know a lot of Bones people always want to have the skeleton on it. But it's, well, it's, it's, not, it's not hidden. I checked. I was going to say there's a skeleton. But it's not, it's not the skeleton. So for you purists out there, here you go. So we're doing a three-way review, guys. We have it in cold brew. We have it in drip. And we have it in espresso before we actually taste it. We should give it a smell, though. So I'll let you smell like, it first. You're, you're, stare, you're looking for the, the skeleton, Because right? there's, like, faces in here. It's not. I don't know. You should, you can open it, just. It smells good. Okay, I'm gonna open it to actually smell it. So. it smells like caramel brownie. Mm -hmm. It smells as advertised, so there you go. So, that's good, Sm passes the smell test. Let's move to the cold brew. 24 hour cold brew. Tasting like a boss. Okay. <laughs> Tasting like a boss. Here we go. It's good. It's Man, good. that is really good. That is really sweet and, and good. And I taste the caramel. You can taste the brownie. Already just. Boom! Boom! I'm laughing at him. <laughs> Sorry. Was, boss of boss is over there making fun of us, but no, this is this no, this is makes it worth it already. So it's good. Not only is a mug awesome, but the cold brew is awesome. So already for me, this is a winner. So big thumbs up on the cold brew for me. How about you? Yeah, it's good. Yeah, I mean, it's a little bitter for my taste. It's that's little, just because I like a little sweetness in my coffee. 
Mm, okay, now, moving to the drip. Smells great. All right, here we go. Tastes like a boss. Really good too. I mean, it doesn't just taste like a cup of coffee. It tastes like brownie. Don't taste the caramel as much though. Some dark chocolate brownie. Yeah. I like milk chocolate. <laughs> I like milk chocolate. I like fudge. I like fudge. <laughs> brownie boy. <laughs> what? <laughs> I like fudge. I like fudge. This does taste uh, in the uh, <laughs> in the drip. It definitely tastes more dark chocolate as opposed to the the cold brew. The cold brew tastes like a brownie with caramel. This doesn't have the caramel notes. It tastes more like dark chocolate. But it would be good with man, some that's chili. good. And uh, it's not just a good cup of coffee. It's a good flavored coffee. So thumbs it's up. It's the world's best. All right. Cup of coffee. Oh, look, look at me. Oh, did you get your Hades down? Yeah, I think I you mixed up the mugs here. Thank you. All right, espresso. Couldn't find the espresso cups because somebody, I don't know who. They're in the sink. Um, okay, well, someone didn't clean them, so had to use these. All right. I was at work. I'm a working girl. She is a working girl right now. You should see your shoulder pads. All right, taste, <laughs> tasting like boss. Espresso, here we go. No, don't do it. No. That's horrible, <laughs> right? It just needs milk. No, it, it no, it needs. Yes, it does. I like strong coffee because then it goes good with milk. But if it's, it's just strong, then no, 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 no. Okay, here, here's the deal. That was sour. The, okay, it's sour from the moment it touches the lips. You know what that it was? It doesn't get better. It's garbage. Don't do espresso. And by the way, just because it doesn't work as espresso doesn't mean it's a bad cup of coffee. Just don't waste it on espresso. So that's just absolutely not. I don't know why that even would happen. You got the chocolate. You got the dark chocolate notes. Why it turns as sour that is like this, I have, I have no idea. This is like... That was haunted. It was haunted. It was gross. Uh, okay, so... Espresso, thumbs down. Drip, thumbs up big time. Cold brew, big thumbs up. How about you? Thoughts? Um, yes. Um, I don't like the espresso, but I would like it with milk. I said that before. Mm -hmm. um, oh, you can have it. I'm, the I'm drip, also, I think it'd be good with cream. My mom also drinks coffee with cream, and she would probably agree with me. Yep, okay. she's nodding off screen. Well, Actually. the remainder of this is going to be done in cold brew. I'm going to oh, steal it. I'm going to tell the family that I'm making them uh, this, but they're not going to get it. I'm going to cold brew this because I'm selfish. So until next time. Wait, hit, hold on. Oh, what, what? Um, this just made me think of Taylor Swift because it's Haunted Mansion, like Haunted from Speak Now. So stream Speak Now Taylor's version. Yes, Taylor Swift definitely needs a little bump from this channel. Bones Coffee should do it. If, they, if they should just, if, if, if some of our viewers could just. I don't know, like Taylor Swift. I think they could do a lavender thing, like lavender haze, right? Or a sweet nothing. They could do like a type of flavor with like, your, I am literally Bones Coffee PR team. I'm giving away heaven right now. Like you don't use my idea actually. I, don't, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I'm gonna do it if you take it as copyright. I guess it's already done. Well, until, hey, listen. Thank you guys for subscribing and following and everything else. Hopefully this is good. Hey, if you get the flavor, I know a lot of you are, and you have different comments and you want to share, hey, please share it in the comments section. Hit like, subscribe, share, everything else. We're close to 300 viewers and subscribers. Thank you so much. And until next time, keep... Gold, my, my mom said gold rush. That would be a cool one. And they could, you know, make it somehow. You know when you put, like, gold flakes in liquid and spin it and it's, like, sparkly? So what you're, have an add -on. You're, you're telling Bones to make a connection with Taylor Swift yes. and then create Taylor Swift themed coffee. And one of the flavors, you want to have gold pieces in it like Gold Schlager. They should have 10 because there's 10 different albums slash eras and they could choose one coffee per one. And then there can be a song that inspired it. That's all and you they need. They could do a package per album. Oh my God. And
Right? Thank you. That's, that's Thank you. Bones, that's all you need to do. Women is get just, stuff done. Bones, Hire me. that's all you need to do to become even more popular. <laughs> you need to <laughs> you need to make a connection with Taylor Swift, obviously, and sell coffee to Taylor Swift fans. Yes. Make it vegan, though. It is. I don't know why it wouldn't be. It would just be vegan. Until next time, guys. He tastes like a boss. <laughs>